Childhood Story Matters for Better Mental Health from Healing Connection, Support, Educate and Advocate. The Story of a Mother by Farhana. The journey of thousand miles begins with one step. Here is a story of a journey of a mother. There is enduring tenderness in the love of a mother to a son that transcends all other affections of the heart. Everyone knows the saying, blood runs thicker than water, meaning family is everything. And it always is for a mother, especially for the mother who lost her husband and the father of her children when they were young. This is a story of exactly that. There once was a family of three, a mother and two sons. The father died when the sons were young, so the single mother raised them on her own, overcoming any struggle or obstacles. Once the sons became teenagers, the oldest got into depression and things changed. He started doing heavy drugs. His situation got worse with depression and drug abuse over time to the point where he would threaten and abuse his mother for refusing to give him money. And one day, the eldest had had enough of it. He asked his mother for money again. When his mother refused, he got a knife and started to threaten her. His younger brother stepped in and was stabbed in place of her mother. And he did not survive. When the eldest was arrested for this, he did not go to jail since he was an addict and was under the influence of heavy drugs at the time of his arrest. He went to rehab. This mother who raised her sons all alone not only has one son facing murder charges, but the other gone forever. She is now scampering around to seek proper treatment and help to only family she has left in any way she can. But what about her, her health, her emotional well-being, her mental state? Is she in any position to be doing this? Who is helping her cope with what happened? Fortunately, her emotions and well-beings was taken care by community support programs. She was given the same amount of importance as her son. She was eligible for the services offered within the program, such as social support, financial support, mental health support. She attended many family counseling programs to keep her mind occupied in a healthy way. So also attended, she also attended self-care workshop. Our goal is to build a resilient community together. You can find us at www.healingconnectionhc.com. We are here to support, educate, and advocate.